Let's hit the road, buddy. Let's hit the road. Let's do this. Well, it's very clear that Nathan's a stylish kind of guy. Sporting his A-Life shoes, of course, his G-Star Raw and TW Steel watch. So, it was only fitting that he took us to his favorite store for some, uh, retail therapy. Hi, I'm Karina. Welcome to G-Star Stockholm. When you're shopping like this, you know, obviously you have a recognizable face, you know. Is this nice and quiet for you, or do you sometimes get that odd fan? I've had a few yeah. people come up to me, but not, not that, that much. So, so that's why you like this place, because yeah. it's not too much, but you can still get around and do your shopping and yeah. look fresh to death? Yeah. Uh, cool, man. You know, I'm not a fashionista, but I can tell you, I give you a little advice, and when you put this on, if it works or it doesn't, you know. Go handle your business, mate. <laughs> I'll be honest. Where's all the money gone? The G-Star crew in Stockholm, and you're watching Gold Diggers. Here at Gold Diggers, we've designed a challenge to test our footballer under pressurized conditions that he might face on the field. First up is the staring contest. The player needs to stay into the camera for as long as he can without blinking. Being a first guinea pig, Nathan sets the pace for others to follow with a cool 7.24 seconds. All right, cool, next. A football player needs to have the skills to outwit his opponent, right? So we figured a classic game of rock, paper, scissors would be the perfect test. After a rocky start, I smoked him. You know who it is. Watch this space over the season to see how I fare against the other players. And then, of course, there's the old classic that speaks for itself. The player needs to keep the ball off the ground for as long as possible. Nathan was playing it safe and not trying anything too fancy. In fact, he went on for a lot longer than I thought it would. Finally, one minute, 53 seconds and 167 taps later, Nathan sets the benchmark. Ah, uh, no, 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 nice one, Nathan, boy. Uh, you know, you're quite good with the soccer ball, unlike uh, some of us. <laughs> off season, baby, off season, now me. I want to know how good you are with this, though. Mm, the this is the ultimate test, my homeboy, you know. I just want to hear how long you can blow the Vuvuzela for and how good you are. Because, you know, we just don't want to hear hot air. <laughs> cool, my man. When you ready? <laughs> you're not going to be going. <laughs> hey, you're not going to be going. No, no, no. <laughs> I know. You know what? That was a practice. Let's be fair, guys. That was a practice round. OK, we're going to give him another turn. When you ready, oh boy. No pressure, all right? <laughs> <laughs> OK, OK. I was being a bit hard on him, so um, I also gave it a go. Hey, man, you know, it's not as easy as you think. Yeah. Okay, one more time. Oh, he had it one time, you know, two times. <laughs> okay, that's how it is. <laughs> it's official. <laughs> I suck. This is a fake movie, Zella. <laughs> <laughs> this is not South Africa, this is Swedish, man. <laughs> Okay, uh, fair square, um, you know, there's something wrong with this Vuvuzela, dog. It's not that we're bad, it's something wrong with this. I'm gonna get it checked out, dog. A phone call, yeah. You know what I mean? With that said, Nathan takes the lead by 4%. All right, check it out. Do yourself a favor, catch our next episode to see who break these records. We have reached that part of the show where we have to say goodbye to you, but thank you all so much, Nathan, my man. You've been a fantastic host. Before you say goodbye, can you just give all the youngsters out there, all the channel, little family out there, some words of wisdom? Work hard, stay humble, and be leaving yourself. No doubt. Peace out, homie.